Hello and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be looking through VLOOKUPs. VLOOKUPs stand for Vertical Lookups, and they're hugely useful to be used in Excel. So what we're going to do first is go through the function syntax, essentially, itself. So we have VLOOKUPs. So the first part to the VLOOKUP is the lookup value. So this is essentially the value in which we'll be searching for in the formula. The next part is the table array. So this will be the table that we're going to be searching for that initial lookup value. Next, we've got the column index number. So this will be the field, uh, this will be the column, sorry, that we're going to be looking to return the value from that we want. And then lastly, we've got the range lookup. This will be essentially where it will provide either a true or false statement. False means that we'll be provided back with an exact match, and in true, it will be a similar match for what we want that output value to be. So what I'm going to do here now is I'm now going to perform a VLOOKUP to find the price of the avocado product. So we, what we can do is VLOOKUP. We're going to look for avocado within this table array. And then we want the price, so we're going to provide column 3 as the column index number and then we want an exact match. So this should now return one pound as the price. So we can see there that that's worked successfully. Um, and this can be hugely useful in, um, in a large data set when you're looking for phone numbers, for example, for a customer, and you just want it then to auto-populate um, and a, a variety of different use cases. So I'm now gonna go into a second example of the VLOOKUP. So what we can see here is that we've got the products and we've got the price of the products, but we haven't got the product ID. So we do have the product ID on this previous sheet. So what we can do is again use the VLOOKUP to get the product ID from that separate sheet into this sheet. And then it should auto populate for the rest of the products itself. So if we do again a VLOOKUP, if we select mushrooms here at the top. And then for our table array, we're now going to go back to that, that first sheet, select that as our table array. We want the product ID, so we're going to provide that as our column index number, so number two. And then we want, again, an exact match. So this should now bring back these five different product IDs in that new, in that separate sheet. So as you can see here, that's now worked. So we now have the product ID for mushrooms and if I now click there it should now auto populate so we've now got all five product IDs for all the different products so this can be yeah, hugely useful and save you a lot of time in Excel um, just by using this this vertical lookup to get um, to get the values that you need for whatever your UK use case may be thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video